doing welcome to uh courtney wellness companion and today we are making low carb chicken lettuce wraps so if you look on the screen to my right your left um you will see the ingredients so real quick i'm just going to show you um we are making um this easy keto low carb pf chang's chicken lettuce wraps and this is uh, by Stay Snatch, uh, Brandy Crawford. And this is a super simple recipe. And um, let's make it together. So I'm just gonna put that on the side and I'll make this with you. So we need um, for the, the chicken part, we need um, a pound of ground chicken or whatever protein you have. So I happen to get ground chicken, um, one onion. So we're gonna cut this onion. This should come out to be about a cup. Um, salt and pepper to taste. We all have that, salt and pepper and uh, green onions. And I already have the chop. This is from my garden. Um, water chestnuts, I don't have water chestnuts but I have um, jicama. I couldn't find any canned water chestnut, so I just use jicama. Um, so the idea is to get a little bit of crunchy uh, and it's a little bit sweet, so this will uh, do the job. Um, and then we have our, I have two types of lettuce. I'm not sure which one I'm gonna use. I have romaine hearts, hearts of romaine, as well as um, cabbage. So we'll see what I use. I couldn't find any bib lettuce either. So, but the most important part here is the homemade hoisin sauce. Okay. So we're going to make that first. And, um, cause that's going to tie everything together. So, um, welcome everybody. Um, the recipes on the screen right there. And we, right now we're going to make the homemade hoisin sauce. So the sauce that um, the original, original restaurant uses is full of sugar, which is not exactly very good for our blood sugar. And it raises um, your blood sugar and it's just not good. It keeps you, it tastes delicious, but um, not so good for you if you're trying to be, uh, avoid, um, you know, a sugar crash. Okay, hey, Regina. Thanks for watching. Um, okay, so so let's make the sauce first. So we need five tablespoons of soy sauce. So um, I have tamari. You can use tamari, you can use soy sauce, um, coconut aminos if you're uh, allergic to soy. So there are lots of options. So I'm gonna grab my tablespoon. And so we're gonna make, this is a peanut buttery soy sauce base kind of uh, dressing. It's gonna be coating our um, chicken. And if you are happen to be vegetarian or vegan, you can use a, you can use tofu or you can use like Regina's using, uh, I think she's using some type, some type of plant-based chicken. So that's three. Four, five, and this recipe is super refreshing, especially um, in the summer. And this is also good for like um, picnics and barbecues and stuff. You bring it, um, they're gonna be super impressed. So I got my um, soy sauce. Okay, now we need, um, Let's see, I'm gonna add all of my liquid stuff. So we need one table teaspoon of hot sauce or sriracha. So I have this garlic, chili garlic sauce. 
this that I'm going to put in. That. So you can use whatever hot sauce you get you you want. You can use like this Frank's red hot red hot sauce if you want. Whatever you like. Okay, two teaspoon of sesame oil. So I got that. Let's do two. So I'm just putting in all our liquids. So, so far we got soy sauce, hot sauce, sesame oil. All right, next is rice wine vinegar. Okay, so this is my rice wine vinegar. We need two teaspoon of that. All right, how's your day going, everybody? Mine's going great. I just woke up from a nap <laughs> and then, um, took a took a shower. Um, we went to a butterfly garden today, so we got some monarch caterpillars. Super cool. So we're, that's going to be our summer project with the kids. Okay, so one tablespoon of sweetener. So I use monk fruit, Lepanto monk fruit. Um, this is a zero calorie sweetener. This is what it looks like. Um, it's a, a blend of erythritol and monk fruit extract. So it's zero calories and zero carbs because um, the sweetener is a sugar alcohol. So it won't affect your blood sugar or anything like that. Um, all right, so we need, how much do we need? Uh, one tablespoon of sweetener, okay. So, so far, so good. So then we got our sweetener and we needed some garlic powder. All right, half a teaspoon of garlic powder. All right, and then I need to um, mince my garlic. So it says two cloves. I have a couple more cloves because, you know, garlic. You can't have enough garlic, I don't think. You never go wrong with garlic, so I'm just doing a quick mince of the garlic um let's see let's scoot my thing back let's do a quick mince and not uh, so let's do a rough chop nothing fancy oh regina's backstage i don't see you regina can you uh request again I don't see you, Regina, so can you come back? Okay, so I'm just doing a rough top of my garlic. I used to have like um, the jar garlic. We haven't purchased those, so I'm just using fresh garlic right now. I'm handling cooking and tech today. So, um, all right. So, come. Okay, let me share the link. Hold on a second. All right, here we go. All right. I Okay, so let's continue. Again, Regina, I just did. Oh, for some reason, I don't see you. Hmm. I'm not sure, babe. Usually, uh, when you're backstage, I see you pop up, and I'll let you in. Share link to Messenger. I did. I just did. Um, it's right there. I just shared it. Um, so hopefully you can get in. And if you're commenting, I don't see your name. It just says Facebook user who ever said share a link to Messenger. So just please allow um, StreamYard to see who you are. Um, so I know who's commenting. Oh, there you are. There's Regina. StreamYard to see who you are. Hi guys! Hey, hey, hey! Welcome back, family! What 
hoisin sauce right now. Ooh, yummy. Yeah, so let me put the recipe up again. You guys can all see. I'm taking a picture of this because this is one of my favorite meals to eat. Oh, is it? Yes. Okay. So, okay. I got all my stuff measured out ahead of time. So. Oh, good. Good. I haven't. <laughs> So you you're you're gonna catch up with me. So right now I just have the soy sauce, uh, the liquid, the sesame oil, the hot sauce, the wine vinegar, rice wine vinegar, sweetener, garlic powder. Um, now I need some peanut butter. So you need two tablespoons of natural peanut butter. So I'm using this Santa Cruz uh, organic peanut butter. So this is gonna be like sweet and peanut buttery and. And I uh, Smucker's all natural peanut butter. Ooh. Do you, you have that? Yeah. I, there's nothing in it but peanuts and less than of salt. So I yeah. always bring That's perfect. That's all, that's all we need in our peanut butter. We don't need anything else. Okay, we're adding the peanut butter now? Yeah, so just put everything in there in a, in a, in a thing. Just mix it up. Make a little salt and pepper to taste. Mm -hmm. Oh, and for instead of soy sauce, just coconut aminos. Oh, you have coconut aminos? I have that too, but I am using um, tamari. Yes, tamari, I love it because it's a, it's a lower sodium and it's a dark soy. Yeah. Okay. So there's, no, there's no sugar in this. So it's just water and soybean, salt. Yeah. So it's less than a gram of salt, so I mean sugar. Yeah, so I, I'm out of tomorrow. So the only thing I have was aminos and low sodium soy sauce. Mm. So, the sauce is so good, man. <laughs> you want to drink it, huh? So good you can drink it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah. It's that good. It's that good. So um, I got my sauce here. It's what it looks like. Nice and thick. Yeah. Oh, that looks good. Whisk. Okay. Whisk, whisk. Whisk away. All right. So while, while that sits, I'm going to chop up my onion. You need about a cup of onion, a cup of diced onion. So I have a small onion. So just, you already diced yours? I need to chop it, man. No, I'm going to them. For meal prep today, they had chicken prep salad. So uh, red onion. The bell pepper left from their salad. Okay. I love it. Yeah. Yeah, I don't have like the, the fancy chopping skills as a as a trained chef like you, Regina, but it does the job. As long as I don't slice my fingers, that's that's the important part. Well, the way you, you're chopping and the way it sounds, it sounds like you went to on blue lady. <laughs> wow, that's a little bit generous, but I'll take it. <laughs> you take, take all you can get, right? <laughs> I'll take it. Um, yeah, so there's my onion chopped. Yes, yes, yes. And then I have um, one bell pepper, an orange one. Okay. Mine is red. Okay. Yeah. I, I, love, I love colored bell peppers. They're just so beautiful to look at. Yes. You feel like you're eating healthy when you have all the different colors, right? <laughs> exactly, exactly. And you so tell me to not. Chop it up. How's your day going, ladies? Day's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, I had a busy day. It's busy every day for you, Regina. You're always cooking, right? Every day? <laughs> I want to be next door to you both. <laughs> yeah. um, 
Imagine our uh, Hawaiian retreat. Come on. It's going to be nuts. Oh, my goodness. Yes. I can't wait. <laughs> As we're cooking today's mokai chicken lettuce wrap. It is, you know, again, this is uh, one of the uh, recipes from, uh, what is the name of that restaurant? Uh, E.F. Chang's. E.F. Chang's, yes. Yeah, it's really good. Chicken. What's that? How much chicken? One pound of chicken. Okay, so my um plant based the package is only eight ounces. Okay, that works. I guess I could use like half half thing. You you just have less chicken. You can fill it. You can fill it more with uh, vegetables if you want. Um, and then um, for the, um, I didn't have water chestnuts. Uh -huh. So I, I use, I topped up a jicama, which is kind of serves the same purpose. It's got a little crunchy, it's white. Yeah, I couldn't find those. So anything crunchy uh, will do. Okay. So use what you got is, 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 is my philosophy. Can you uh, use daikon? You can use daikon. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you could. It's crunchy. It's white. It's got mm -hmm. a little bit of sweetness. Um, I guess for those uh, vegetarians, we could, we, they could use tofu as well, right? You can use tofu, crumble tofu, whatever you want. All right, so let's let's get on to um, let's get on to the uh, so here's the we're gonna cook the chicken now, okay? So we need chicken, we need onions, okay. uh, salt and pepper chestnuts or jicama or whatever stuff you can even use green onions and then um the lettuce you can use a bib lettuce or butter or any type of lettuce romaine i have romaine hearts right here. oh you got the good lettuce i couldn't find those either all right so we did the homemade hoisin sauce it's all nice and mixed <coughs> so i need to heat up my pan so i have a little here I'm gonna I'm gonna use some um, olive oil to cook mm. up the okay olive oil okay yeah what are you using Is uh, that... okay. yeah this is gonna take a minute for my thing to heat up okay so how do you ladies like utilizing the electric stove do you prefer one over the other I actually like it because it's easier to clean up. Because I've always had gas, and uh, I never, I always had like bad feelings about the electric because people say it's takes sl it's slower and all that stuff. But like, I actually like it. Okay, I love gas. Me too. <laughs> I guess in culinary school and in the restaurant, we cooked with gas. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I, I could love it. gas. Yeah, I love gas too. I'm a fast cooker. I, I find that I cook always on high with the electric stove. Believe it or not. Yeah, it's like you got to cut it on high. To yep. Heat up <laughs> on it. All right. So it's heating up. It's not there yet. Okay. So if, you're, if your skillet is, is hot, medium high heat, you want to add your um, ground chicken to the skillet. Okay. Okay. So I have my ground chicken. Okay. It's still heating up, so just gonna wait. It's it's yeah. Don't add cold chicken or cold protein to a pan because that's that's not good. Don't want it soggy. You want it to sear and get nice and crispy and crunchy and <laughs> exactly. Yes, what she said. She's she knows the reason why. You went to culinary school, right? Um. Yes, I I did go, but unfortunately. Um, I could not finish because I was working two jobs to take care of my kids. Oh, yeah. Part of being a <clears throat> parent. That's um, rough. I did go back to school and did something totally different. So I went back and I have an associate of arts. Nice. Okay. You never, you never, you never awesome. So, so for me, I uh, did not go to any professional culinary school. It's just this is just uh, learning from blogs and other home cooks and things like that. I learned 
more from working at different restaurants and just watching people's blogs and watching videos and more from that than I did in culinary school for a year. Oh, wow. I'll say something. All right, so I'm going to add my chicken to the tag. Cast iron is. So I'm using a nonstick. Okay. Cast iron. Well, if I'm being lazy, all the nonstick skillets are all the way in the back of the cabinet, but the cast iron was right up front, so that's what I did. It's all about the convenience, right? All right, so we're gonna cook the chicken for three to four minutes. So you're gonna just distribute it, break it down. You don't want big clumps. I thought I had time before we started, so I made some cookies. What did you do? I made some cookies. I had a little bit of time before. I made some. I saw some of the cinnamon buns. Yeah, I said I was going to make those, and I ended up making cookies, but I'm going to make those in the morning. <laughs> I love it. So I made some um, roasted garlic this morning Ooh. in the air fryer. Oh it's so good. God. And then I made some lamb meatballs. Oh my God, that's good too. Yeah, that's good too. All right, so season your chicken with your salt and pepper if you want. Okay. Pepper. Yes, you need to season your meat. Yeah. We don't want any bland food here. Tioko says, holy yum. <laughs> yeah. I'm telling you, it smells good already. Like, I'm just smelling it's made, and I'm just like... I got like, I love soy, I love peanuts, I love rice wine vinegar, like all the things that yeah. that way, yeah. A little Asian style, all the flavors come together. Patricia, who's cooking dinner tonight? Well, it's every man for himself for dinner tonight. <laughs> I got Issa. <laughs> Every Jacob's for themselves tonight, with the exception of Issa. <laughs> um, last night, Courtney made some really, really delicious salads. And we had, for me, for the first time, uh, sardines. He fried up the sardines and put them over our salad. It was delicious. Oh, that sounds good. That's yes. Good. Yep. It was delicious. Um, tonight it is, you know, it's 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 a free all night, free for all night. <laughs> all right, so my chicken has brown. I'm gonna move it to the side. Okay. And add my onions to caramelize. Okay, so I got my onion already chopped. Okay. Okay, and um, you can also add your uh, bell peppers at this time too. Cook at the same time. So this recipe didn't call for the the bell peppers, but I just add, I thought the bell peppers add a nice color. Yes, it's really pretty. I'm gonna cook for about two minutes. I think we're like halfway there, guys. Yeah, because I'm hungry. You're cooking, Frankie. Isn't that how they say it on the home alone? 
I'm just greedy. I just like to eat. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to eat. I love food too. I mean, I am I am a foodie of all foodies. Like literally, we got to go to um, India and their market. Oh my gosh, you know. Go to a couple of places you know, uh, across, you know, Africa, India, you know, China, Japan, and go to their food and fish markets. That's what we need to do. Yeah, I'm all for that. Yes. Foodies unite. That's right. All right, so while that, I'm going to clean up my uh, lettuce. Do I hear a, a Jake's Fitness uh, travel food show? Maybe we need to start pitching uh, that idea to, but what is the name of the, the travel channel? <laughs> Bunch of health and wellness coaches going on a, a taste of the world tour. <laughs> I'm all for that. We'll have, no. we'll have Andrew Zimmern as our guide. <laughs> yes, yes, I'm you, I can watch him all day. <laughs> yes, me too. <laughs> We love you, Andrew Zimmerman, wherever you are. <laughs> I, I Anthony Bourdain. Yeah, Anthony Bourdain was good. Yeah, he's a good guy, too. Yeah. All right, so let me see if I can move my computer over. <laughs> Andrew Zimmerman makes you want to taste things you, you really don't think you'd ever want to taste. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, what was it? Here it is. Oh my goodness, look at that. Yummy. All right. Oh me, oh my. <laughs> oh, me, oh my. Oh, I like that. Wee. Yes, Regina. All right, so let's see. Oh. We do need a film crew here. All right, where you go? <laughs> Where's your helpers? I have no helper. It's just me. They're staying out in the kitchen. That's helping me. <laughs> Right. Oh, boy, how I know, how I know the feeling. <laughs> oh, well. Just don't ask me for anything. <laughs> All right. Well, looking good, guys. Got pop of color. I'm gonna turn my piano. That cast iron holes. <laughs> Chicken and uh, peppers. Yeah. That looks good, Mai. Oh yes, God. it does. How's yours look? Let me see your chicken. I can't believe I'm saying that about regular chicken. But that looks good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll get you some. Sit down. I'm like, okay, how can I that? All right, next, we're gonna add our chestnuts or hickama, whatever you got for the crunch. Okay. Some green onions. Onions. Okay. Oh, yeah. Now we're gonna add our sauce, our peanut butter, soy sauce. Oh yeah. We're gonna be eating like a couple minutes, guys. Well, me and Regina anyways. <laughs> Bye. We're rubbing it in, my. We'll beam you up some chicken lettuce wrap. Oh my God, look at this. Well, I didn't have water chestnuts or but I did have some uh, English cucumber that was left over. Okay, yeah, add it in there. We want a little bit of crunch. Yeah, that's that well, looks have... delicious. Oh my goodness! You get all the sauce. You don't want to leave any behind. <laughs> yum, yum, yum. Yeah, I want all that goodness. Yep, so taste to see if we need to add any more salt and pepper. Okay, let's 
see. How's it taste, Regina? That is awesome. That is awesome. <laughs> that mm -hmm. is awesome. I'm a little weird, so uh, a touch more rice wine vinegar. Just a little bit. I like a little bit. more green. Okay. Then I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. You're this good. Thing. All right. Yeah. Okay. All right, I think I think mine's pretty well incorporated. How's yours? Yeah, it's looking pretty good. A little bit more <laughs> pepper. <laughs> really. All right, turn off the heat. Okay, turn it off. Take a picture. My goodness, look at that. <clears throat> All right, now all we need to do is put it in the lettuce and then, and then we eat. Wow. Okay. All right, let me just do a little bit of cleanup here so I can some room. <laughs> Are you gonna put some rice strings in there? Uh, some what? what? What do they call that? The fried rice strings or whatever they call it. Cauliflower rice? Cauliflower rice? Or what? Are you talking about noodles? Yeah, the rice noodles, crunchy noodles. Um, I don't have any. <laughs> there you go. I, mean, I say everything. I don't even care. <laughs> oh, you got prepared, there you, lady. There you go, Regina. <laughs> I'm going to indulge in those carbs today. Oh, my God. I'm going to turn my camera off. <laughs> I'm jealous. I'm jealous. I'm more zealous. <laughs> my yeah. goodness. All right. So I got my skillet here. I got my lettuce. What else do we need? I think that's it, right? Yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I, need, I need a plate. Here. I'm just right out of the pot, <laughs> my. What was that? I said, I'm eating right out of the pot. <laughs> you know, From the pot to the, to the lettuce wrap. Okay. <laughs> Just take the whole pan to the table, make this in a big bag, put a big plate of lettuce, put like little yes. and be like, hey, let's just have at it. Oh my goodness, yes. All right, yeah, so this is good for like taco night too. Ooh. Yeah. So mine is not a pretty bib lettuce, but it'll do. Yes. He'll do, he'll do, he'll do. Now, would your kids eat this, Mai and Regina? Huh? Would your children eat this? Well, my kids are older, so of course they would. But my grandson, I would have to come and try it. Just taste it. <laughs> All right. But I think after it, he, he would love it. Oh, Avita's here. <laughs> Avita. Hey. Are you getting hungry? Ooh. Hey, Vita. All right. So this is this is my lettuce wrap. We oh. can't hear you, Avita. Oh, Ooh, nice, my nice. Look All at right. that. Look Regina, you're, you're putting on the crunchy stuff. Well, I don't really have it. I'm not going to put the rice noodles on. I started to, but I'm not because I want to save those carbs for a cookie that I made. <laughs> Use them wisely, right? Yes. <laughs> so my little crunch, I put some <clears throat> seeds. Nice. Oh, oh, that's a good idea. I'm going to do that too. Yeah. I, I was looking, I was like, well, I got black seeds. That's me. Good wow. idea, good idea, sesame seed. Oh my God, this is, all right. Then I look mm, mm, mm. I'm good to go. All right, so you're, you're making four? Yeah, that's what I'm gonna start out eating. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I just put sesame seed Oh, oh wow. Yeah, your, your lettuce looks really pretty. Is that the bib lettuce or the butter lettuce? Yeah. 
because I looked and I saw the romaine and I was like, oh, I can get romaine and it could be like a little boat, you know? Yeah, but yeah. It didn't look that good today. So I just want the big lettuce. Yep. Yeah. I also have like um, cabbage, but I'm, I'm doing the romaine. Okay. That sounds delicious. Cabbage, yeah. Yeah. All right. Are we ready to try? Yes. Cheers. Cheers. It's hot. <laughs> oh, no. Nice. Mm -hmm. And I just got to do it. I got to do something. So I guess I'm just going to do some more. <laughs> <laughs> that looks so yummy. I'm going to try to make it when I get home. I was at the African dance. Just look at right. that side of that. Like, look at that. Like, that's oh my gosh. Uh, yummy, yummy, yummy. Like the peanut butter sauce. Mm. I don't know if I'm more excited because it's so good or if I'm more excited that I was able to make it plant based for me. Oh, wow. I'm just so excited mm. to be able to do that. Mm. And it tastes really good. Well, I guess you go, Dina. Hi. I guess everything can be made plant based, right? I mean, you made pulled pork from a plant. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that was so good. I still need to try that. Mm. All right. I mean, finger licking look good. What? What else can I say? <laughs> Finger licking good. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. So there, there's the recipe. Bravo, ladies. Bravo. I am definitely making this again. Uh huh. For some the clients, clients will want this too, right? Huh? Clients will want this too. Yeah, I think it's it's a it's crazy because um I just get, I just made them Caribbean chicken lettuce cups on Monday. Oh. What's in the Korean Caribbean lettuce cup? Want to know? Chicken is seasoned with like uh, smoked paprika, oregano, garlic powder. You know those a uh, little bit of cayenne, those types of flavors, and like this with the multicolored peppers, the onions. It's just the seasoning is different. Mm -hmm. you, like just in lettuce, I think for them I use uh, romaine. Regina, it looks like you have a hungry, a hungry patron back back there. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be scoping it out. I have a hungry pa patron back there. This is my son that's in the military. He was in Korea. It's we, it's we can't see him. Yeah. Come closer. Hi, young man. How are you? <laughs> Thank you so much for your service. Yes. It's um a lettuce cup. A low carb lettuce cup. Yeah. Now we want your honest opinion. <laughs> yeah, he ain't gonna lie. He gonna he gonna be <laughs> like soy sauce and rice vinegar, peanut butter. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> you said that's gas. Yes. That's a yes. <laughs> Other side to come. <laughs> so that's that's a that's a Y that's a Y A S S S S S, right? Yes. Yes, honey, yes. Yes, make this. I'm going to um a barbecue or tomorrow on Saturday. I think I'll bring this. Hello. Hello. Mm. Oh my, uh, we, we, we just, we're going to have to remix, um, what's the uh, Khalil song? I think that's her name, Khalifa or Khalil, whatever. All, all my, all my chicken wraps bring the boys to the yard. <laughs> all my chicken wraps bring the boys to the yard. And they're like, yeah, so it's yummy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's a remix. Remix, all gone too. Wow. <laughs> Lick the plate. My mm. goodness. Yummy, yeah. yummy, yummy. I cannot I cannot wait to make this for my husband when he comes home because he's on the road right now. 
I think he would really, really enjoy it. I think that is awesome. It looked good. And uh, I am so happy I got to spend this time with you ladies uh, before. Um, you know, I, I, I bought you guys. It was a quick meal. I love that. What, 35 minutes about? Mm -hmm. um, you know, this would be something really good for single moms to make and leave as a leftover for the kids to warm up and put it, you know, inside the lettuce. It's a healthy meal. Uh, that you could feed your kids, you know, it's, it, this is top notch uh, dining tonight. So thank you ladies for yeah. making this. It's thank awesome. This yeah. Is for the recipe. Yes. yes. Thank yes. you for coming. Uh, stay tuned for the next week's recipe. It might be orange chicken. I don't know. What do you think about oh, that? Yes. <laughs> or are we do for dessert? Dessert too? We can eat the orange. We can eat orange for dessert. Oh, cookies! Yeah. Yeah. I made uh, berry almond oatmeal, and then I made oatmeal chocolate. Then, yes. Like, Wait. Show us the cookies again. Show us the cookies again. <laughs> show, show the cookies. Yes. Those are big. Look at that. Wow. Um, <laughs> I couldn't decide what size I wanted. So I'm going to this size, the smaller one. These are cranberry almond. Whew. So Panera Bread makes this cookie called Kitchen Sink. Have you got, well, has anybody had that Kitchen Sink cookie from Panera Bread? I have. No. I've made it. You've made it? I've made a Kitchen Sink cookie, yes. With chocolate My chips goodness. and then just like everything. Yeah. Everything. That's that's what we need to make. We need to make a, a low carb kitchen sink cookie. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that's 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 possible. Let's 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 make some cookies. I'm all about the cookie. Okay. Yes. About that orange chicken. Like I'm already thinking in my mind. Okay, I gotta go make sure I gotta put some toast it so I can cook it with her. Yes, I love that. I love the orange chicken too. That's one of my favorites as well. So All right, yeah. orange chicken will be next week's class. Okay, awesome. awesome. All right, guys. All right, bye, everyone. Have a wonderful evening. Bye, Vita. Bye. bye.